Clams or clamshells activate the gluteus medius and hip lateral rotator muscles, which are extremely important for pelvic stabilization and hip mobility. Slide your feet through a loop resistance band so that the band is around both of your thighs. Lie on your side with your knees bent and your head resting on your arm. You may choose to use a pillow for increased neck comfort. Oftentimes when doing this exercise, people place their knees too close to their chest. Instead, your heels should be in line with your glutes. Make sure your spine is in a neutral position, not overly arched or flattened. Use your core muscles to elongate through your torso and ensure there is a little bit of space between your armpit and your pelvis so that you're staying nice and long through your top side. Ants should be able to march underneath your side. Make sure that your shoulders, ribs, hips, knees, and feet are stacked. Now that you're in the correct position, lift your top knee up as far as you can without letting your pelvis rotate backward. Slowly lower your knee back down to the starting position. Keep your feet together throughout the exercise. Exhale as you lift your top knee. Inhale as you lower your knee back down. You should feel this working in the outer hip of your top leg. Make sure as you're lifting your knee up that the hip doesn't move back with it. You can put your hand on your hip to make sure it stays still. Go nice and slow, stay controlled. Your spine should stay in a neutral position. 